Hello everyone, I'm Josh Garrett and in this video, I'm going to be talking about Kari Kala Chola. First of all, we have to know who is Kari Kala Chola. In ancient and medieval times, Kari Kala Chola was a legend and a historical figure associated with the Chola dynasty, which was a powerful South Indian dynasty that dominated a significant portion of the Indian subcontinent during the ancient and medieval periods. Traditionally considered to be one of the greatest Chola kings of all time, Kari Kala Chola is often celebrated for his military prowess and his contribution to the expansion of the Chola empire during his lifetime. The inscriptions and literature of the Tamil language suggest that Kari Kala Chola reigned during the Sangam period roughly dated from the 3rd century BCE to the 3rd century CE, which is roughly based on the Tamil literature and inscriptions of the time. It is, however, difficult to establish exact dates for the period during which he ruled, and the lack of reliable contemporary records can make establishing historical accuracy very challenging. A particularly important work of Karikala Chola is the construction of the Grand Anikat or Kalanai, which is an ancient dam spanning the Kaveri River in Tamil Nadu, India, which has been dubbed the grandest dam in the world. The dam was built in order to regulate the flow of the water and facilitate irrigation, showcasing in this way the king's administrative and engineering abilities. Despite the fact that the historical details of Karikala Chola are somewhat obscure due to the passage of time and the limited number of records available, he remains an important figure in South Indian history and his legacy is preserved in Tamil literature as well as his inscriptions. Now let's move on to his early life. Karikala was the son of Ilamachet Cheni. Karikala's name is held to mean the man with the charred leg. In the early years of his life, Karikala might have been involved in a fire accident that caused him to be born with a charred leg, which could explain the origin of his name. According to some scholars though, Karikala's name may also be interpreted as the slayer of elephants. Now let us hear a famous legend about him. Once upon a time in Ureyur, King Ilamachet Cheni married a princess from Alander, who soon gave birth to Karikala. Sadly, the king passed away shortly after. Because Karikala was still young, people overlooked his claim to the throne, causing chaos in his kingdom. They kicked him out and sent him to exile. But luck turned around when things settled down. Loyal Chola ministers sent out a royal elephant to hunt for the missing prince. The elephant found him hiding in Karur. Unfortunately, Karikala's enemies got wind of it and threw him into jail. That night, their prison sprang up in flames, but Karikala managed to escape thanks to his uncle. Despite this ordeal, Karikala emerged victorious. His leg got burnt in the fire, giving him his new name, and thus the legend of Karikala was born. Karikala also went for military conquests. One of his most famous military conquests is the Battle of Veni. So let's look at it more closely. According to Puranuru, a classic Tamil literary work, Karikala Chola fought a war against the Pandyan and Chera kings, where the Pandyan and Chera kings suffered defeat at the hands of Karikala Chola. Levin minor chieftains also sided with the Pandyan and Chera kings, and they too suffered the defeat at the hands of Karikala Chola. The Chera king later committed suicide by starving himself after the battle. This was a turning point for Karikala Chola as he defeated all the people who sided against him. After the battle, Karikala's place on the throne was firmly established. Many would come later claiming their descent from Karikala Chola and promising to bring back the Chola Empire's glory. 
One man, though, would rise amidst conflict, and seizing the opportunity, he would resurrect the Chola Empire, and so begin the reign of the medieval Cholas. But that is a topic for another video. So goodbye everyone, till then. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Bye.